Yo, what's up, Big 3? This is Josiah Johnson, a.k.a. King Josiah 54 on the internet, and I'm gonna take you inside the film room. So the, the Ricky Davis meme, look, I hate it had to be Ricky. I'm a big fan of Ricky's. Mm -hmm. Was on a group chat with a bunch of friends who had told me the play had happened, so I scrambled home and was like, look, we need to do a mashup of Boys in the Hood. Obviously, it was perfect because his name is Ricky. Cube found the league. It couldn't have been much better. This was one of the ones when I put together, it literally just was like, yo, this is gonna, gonna go viral, it's gonna smash. And obviously, the play was great. B-Rush just kind of hit him, hit him with that sauce. And it was just like, oh, Rick. No, and that's the whole thing. That's what's great about the big three. Y'all play D, it's real life. Like, you will get clowned, you will get embarrassed. And then obviously I had to go back to the uh, the clip of uh, Trey and Ricky, you know, just holding them up lifeless. <laughs> Ricky, Ricky! Here's a matchup. Gaining oh. speed, by the, by Taylor, to the basket! We got, you know, Chicago's very own Will Bynum coming through with a nice, heavy, oop! Sham got, oh, check your ankles, and the nice little fi finish at the bucket. Yeah, you, know, you gotta make sure, if you're playing in the big three, you gotta have ankle insurance because your ankles will get snatched, you know what I'm saying? Ask Ricky Davis, ask some of the other gentlemen who've, who've experienced it. So we got uh, Mr. Frank Nitty, keys to the city. And the thing about Frank is he, he plays with such a chip on his shoulder that he will embarrass you and clown you. I don't know, who, who do you drive by, Rashard Lewis? Or who is that? Oh, this on Maggetti. Oh, Maggetti likes spaghetti. Like, oh. Look at those. And that's the whole thing, man. These dudes are NBA dudes, but them ankles, you really need to stretch, do some yoga, do whatever you're gonna do, do some Pilates, whatever you, whatever you can do to really prepare, because Frank Nitty is coming. He, he's coming with a vengeance, all right? He wants that bag, he wants the clown dudes, he's trying to get buckets. If you're playing against Frank Nitty, you know, tell your friends and family to, to stay off the internet for a little while, because you might get embarrassed. Dak Jack, one of the biggest legends of all time, just straight bucket getter, like, you know, from his early days on. Dude has a great story, played his heart out, CBA, kind of rose the ranks of the NBA, and now he's doing his thing in the big three. And the thing, when, when you guard and stack, you gotta just know that he will give you a bucket, and he has no problem doing it in your grill. Grill sandwiches, as we like to call them in this part of town. He, he's great with them grill sandwiches, just all up in your mouth. You know, nothing you can do about it. Make sure you have a napkin just to wipe off or whatever afterwards, because you're gonna take one to the dome. Here's Joe. Got it! Joe Johnson, obviously one of the greatest shooters of all time. NBA legend, we share we share a similar name. So whenever I hear Joe Johnson on the TV screen, I always look up and say, wait, did I do that? Oh no, okay, they must be talking about basketball and not the memory because Joe's out here really getting it. Cuba's put together a product that people actually wanna watch, unlike some other things that I've seen out there in the space. But like they say, he's no ordinary Joe. Game on the line, oop, fade away perfect. Little MJ, MJ, straight grill sandwich. So, okay, LeBron was there, look at y'all. I can't get LeBron to retweet none of my stuff, but I see he's out here showing love to the big three. What's up, Bron? What's going on, player? Let's have a heart to heart. Who, who's this, Zorro? What we got? Okay, who's that, Royce? Royce out here looking like the black Zorro, okay? All you need is a little Z in this fro, you know what I'm talking about? And hey, look, things will get grimy in the big three. Look, if you're gonna talk to another man to get in this grill, make sure you chew bubble gum, okay? Because you're gonna have stanky breath. Just hooper to hooper, that's one of the things. Like, you know, make sure your breath smells correct. Here's James White, though. So Big Baby is a beast. The thing when he gets real animated, he'll get the saliva like dripping and drooling off of his grill. And it's just like, look boy, mo moisturize. Really, you know, sip some of that spit. Don't let it come out, all right, playboy? Oh, language, what are we doing? Okay, there's kids watching the Big Three. What are we doing, Big Baby? He look like Big Adult Man now. He done, he done really grown and morphed. And that's a big sweaty baby, so I don't really know if I want that jersey like that. I might have to grab it and stash it, you know what I'm saying? I can't really let that thing just hit me like that. And they fighting over big baby sweaty jersey? Oof, that's a lot of grease on that jersey. Oh, do y'all trip it. At the end of the day, if you're a grown man fighting for big babies, you know, jersey and shorts, you're gonna have to tell your kids that at some point because the internet never dies. And they might see that video and be like, Dad, you, you really out there fighting for big baby stuff? <laughs> The fans fight for his jersey. You just watched Inside the Film Room. We appreciate you. Stay tuned to The Big Three for more content as fire as this.